key characters off stage. So many options, so many ways to delay, and so many hitboxes. Uh, and that's something that Gatsby loves to do. He loves to just threaten people off stage. That might not be in the cards from this time around. Also, I don't know how much Sora experience he has. We don't really have a huge, like a plethora of good Sora players around here. So we'll see if Gatsby can possibly adapt to the. Ooh, oh, nice! What? Did, did you see that? He literally he ran just through the thunder. Right through the thunderbolts. I am dead. <laughs> <laughs> Incredible! And now we're seeing some pressure there by DTP. Already popping off like I totally like look how fast he's actually moving with Sora. Incredible. Clearly very comfortable with this character. There's the Thunderbolts. Wasn't able to run through that at all, but Okay, yeah, this is very I the way that DTP is placing his hitboxes, Gatsby is seriously having trouble just finding openings right there. Even a single grab didn't really mean lead to anything. And the up air. That that is Sora up there. Have you ever like just like fro like pause the screen during Sora's up air? That move is gigantic. It is so huge. It is oh, so <laughs> huge. That down air spike that down air spike's gonna do it. A nice job there by Gatsby. Even things out at the stock in zero to zero on this reset. Very yeah. nice job. And I do think that that sort of maybe sets a little bit of a tone for the game here because what happened to Gatsby? He got comboed to like 150, finally got killed off and of And so up quick, air. by the way, I will say. <laughs> yeah, no, he took a lot of damage really quickly, but still he had to get about 150%. Meanwhile, he just like slammed DDP into the ground at like 80. Be hitting again, so comfortable with those Thunderbolts very early on. Nice job. Okay. Thundaga. Oh, they're just throwing out hitboxes! At the board, he's going Gatsby! Yeah, they are off the ledge, tries to fish for it, not gonna happen. Ooh! And oh. reads the roll all the way on the right side of the I platform. Don't, I don't even know if he needed to read. I think that hitbox just might be It's big. so massive. Yeah, it's but... so massive. And Gatsby, there was... Th what a back and forth for that exchange. We'll have to revisit that later, but there's too much match continuously going on. 95%. This is still, Gatsby can close this out at any moment. I like that though, recognizing that the downer is what took his stock last time. Four throw? Doesn't punish that strongly though. Grab is good, but he needs the kill. Yeah, we gotta see Gatsby close out this deficit. Our DTP is gonna continue to rack up damage there on Gatsby now sitting at 51%. Let's see, the freeze is gonna come out. And he's gonna put right into the combo, not gonna happen. Yeah, man, that Farago is so safe. That was... I'm loving it. That's that's the punishes he needs to be finding. But I don't know about you, but I feel like DTP is throwing out those thunderbolts that all the way deep. Good DI there. Though. All right, there is Ooh. absolutely a universe where Gatsby takes this. Oh, oh the Gatsby goodness. stock. And Hold on a second. Oh, he's air dodging. Air dodging against Gatsby. Oh, Do it. My See what happens. Okay, oh. that was actually. Hold on a second. That was sick. That was sick as hell. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> what just happened? Dude, I, I swear, I blinked, and then all of a sudden the combos were coming out, and that was going to be the end of stock. Holy crap. That was so oh, fast. Those combos. Dude, those combos, man. Yeah, here's the thing. Those combos really cool. He was at, like, what, 130 when it started? I'm, I'm no, no, he's, <laughs> like he's at 130 when he got hit. There are lots so of things. Quick. You don't Rack need a combo of the so guy quick. seven times to kill him. Jesus. <laughs> DTP coming in with this Sora, coming in hot. Yeah, and Gatsby, one of Westchester's stalwart players, Absolutely. always in the, one of the top. high end of PR. And right now, he's getting kind of... I mean, that game was close, but nonetheless, he's getting shown up here by DCP. Could it be that we're seeing a little bit of the inexperience against a such a really talented Sora come into play here now? I do think so, especially those more esoteric moves from Sora, like the, the side piece specifically. There have been a few times where Gatsby's been caught by it because he's just not anticipating it homing in on but here we go. This so, is such oh. a great stage here for Gatsby. Yeah, I'm surprised this stage wasn't banned. Oh, oh my lord. I love that high recovery. That good was so high good. high recovery. Knew that DTP oh. was going to come in right underneath, and that was going to do it. I love that, because in game one, he punished uh, the Thundaga with like a like a grab or something. And ever since then, he's been like, no, I'm maximizing it. When he's going to when he's gonna do that in my face, I will kill him for it. That's one thing I will say, DTP was so comfortable with that Thundaga, utilizing it multiple times, exactly how I didn't see it again. Don't really see a lot of stories utilize that so much within a, a, a stock, especially so early or so late. Nice job there, gonna end the stock. Yeah, and that sort of thing where matchup inexperience, it's so hard to know where the actual, like, windows to punish Sora when he's hitting your shield like that are. 
and ooh, is DTP taking advantage of that? Oh, see, like right there again, I, I feel like he half knew that it was going to go to him, but he still uh, was not actually able to find the So patient looking for a window to start those combos, and now he's going to get pushed right off stage with Gatsby getting the advantage here. Oh, what a good up smack. He has no jump. Ooh. Going way out there. I love that. That fastball was going to allow him to recover. A nice job. And now we're seeing Gatsby with this advantage here. 58% fresh on that second stock still. Oh, God. Ooh, look Goes. at the combo king. Doesn't, we don't quite see that. Like, oh, my God. Doesn't matter. Oh, he's alive, though. Good DI. Yeah. Oh, and threads the needle beautifully. Gatsby alive at 114%. Alive. This is it. He's got his first hit, and he has a lot of rage on his body, too. Oh, he misses the grab. I think that uh, DTP slightly moved out the way, was able to DI. Nice job there off stage. Very comfortable. And yeah, if you're Falcon, what do you do there? You're so tempted to air dodge because any hitbox is going to take you out, but DDP just scouts it out and uh, takes the sock regardless. DDP is just a good job of utilizing that Dundaga oh. to add that damage and put in a lot of pressure there against Gatsby. And I don't think Gatsby expects that Dundaga to come out. It just was so randomly. It's also just the hitbox board is so massive. Right, Remember, you is. can sort of anticipate by just looking at a, the, the actual spell slot. You know, you know that if he doesn't have Thundaga there, he can't do it. But like, when there's a match going on like this, it's so hard to keep yeah, track. Yeah, it's gonna have to keep track of and look to see if that's that's an option selected. And there it is. Yeah. Nice job, Gatsby takes it. The end of that game felt kind of like a scramble, honestly. It really did. Like, sometimes when you have last hit situations, like the pace slows down and like, there's razor focus on both parts. That time it was just like people were like, I just want this to be over. Please, <laughs> just let this move play. I know. But uh, here we go. So now we are tied up one to one, guys. We got a match here. Yeah, I will say though, game two was very good for Gatsby, but that stage is amazing for Falcon and Gatsby specifically. Now that we have game three, it's not going to be on uh, Kalos. So let's see if he's able to keep up anyway. Right, this is a good stage. For, uh, Sora's up there just so good on those platforms. Really good. Those platforms are nice and low, so you're going to see those disjoints. You're going to see him poke right through those platforms and rack up damage very quickly there. And one of the things I will say is Gatsby now, he's got a couple matches under his belt against his Sora, so he should feel a little bit more comfortable as you saw that previous win. So maybe there's that. Yeah. Oh, again, the crab just missing. Her, Sora must just... have some like weird hurtbox shifting or something. I like that. Now he's starting to pick up on those things like the Thundaga. Oh, but how much will that matter? And getting pummeled all the way to 141. Gatsby definitely at kill percentage here with 141. Oh, almost gets it. DTB. <laughs> no jump. Back onto stage. This does a really great, jo great job of recovering there. Thundaga's going to put in pressure again with a freeze. Ooh. Oh, reads the moment he was going to break through the ice, and that up special gets it. On yeah. incredible, incredible. And also, keep in mind, right before that, it was the bait with the Thundaga. He threw out that right. Thundaga, and then Gatsby's like, I'm going to get up, neutral get up, use the invincibility. But right then and there is when the Blazaga came out and lets that whole change. Great stuff. Right now, Gatsby needs to even things up immediately. Oh, that'll Ooh. do it. Sure. No tech. Impossible to tech. I think I didn't see the, 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 the damage percentage, but he was not able to tech that. He could be fresh on this stock. Let's see what happens. He's got to. Yeah, we're Keep seeing, the deficit. We're seeing so many moves from Sora. Like, just like throwing Look out the movement. Moves the movement is good, but Gatsby, he's, I like this. Gatsby's slowing down just a little bit and choosing his windows for attack, waiting Very for those nice aerials to job. come out. And look at this. I'm telling you, exactly. he's, he's starting to figure it out. Yeah, yeah he's got to basically be very, very patient, wait to see what option DTP comes out with, and then go and capitalize on exactly what he's doing. Into the knee, to the face. Ladies and that, gentlemen, we got the lead here. Gatsby's doing it. That was just a gorgeous stop. Like, so, oh my god, Gatsby. So pretty. A player who we know for being extremely aggressive, he was still, like, you know, in his face, but it was constantly, he was respecting what his opponent could do, and he was always there to punish. So, so nice. You bring nice. up a really, really good point. With this Falcon, he usually is super, super aggressive in your face and just kind of changed his style up a little bit and became more pa patient, waiting for DTP on the option, and then oh. capitalized. That was good, a good special out of shield. Nice job there. Okay, oh. though. Gatsby still has this lead. 
but it's nowhere close to having this game in the bag. Tries to get the spike. Oh no, wait, 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 wait. that's how you lose, bro. <laughs> that is how you lose. He's got to be careful there. Oh, tries to get the spike. I, Not going to happen. I, I, listen, I understand. I understand why he wants to do it. Every man wants to do it, but like, Maybe not, now is the top. Good up special. <laughs> DTB getting back onto stage. Ooh, I saw that little bit of a wave dash trying to position himself in a different spot to capitalize. There's the Thundaga. Okay. Ooh. Oh. Gatsby has to be so careful. Oh, no punish. It's so hard. It's deceptively oh. hard to punish that move. But now we are neck and neck in percent. Neck this is game three between these two. What Good a parry! parry! Does not capitalize off the parry. Unfortunately, should have taken advantage of that. And there's the down air. It's not enough. And no way! Oh, Good he's alive. Good GI. Hold here on a second. DTP covering the entire stage in that. It's not strong enough. going to go deep. He's like, no, he's respecting it now. But there's the neutral air. And that's going to be wow. it. Nice matchup. And Gatsby <laughs> takes it. Wow, what, that, that was, was, a, that was I also, I just love Gatsby in that game three. He figured out what he needed to be doing. You saw so it. 